Hello, this is Cheryl. I've had lots of requests uh, from people for me to go ahead and show you more of the inside of the house, which is what I'm getting ready to do here. We walk in and the first thing you'll see is our camp kitchen, uh, which will be our kitchen once it's finished. But here is our camp kitchen for now. We've got seating for 10, so plenty of room for people to come to visit. Uh, those are the beautiful flowers that I got from Juliet and George for my birthday. So there they are. This is the cold room, and we're going to be, let me turn on a light here. We're actually going to be making this into the laundry room, uh, it's fairly large. This cooling unit is going out and we're hoping that we're gonna be able to sell it to a restaurant somewhere with the help of Juliet. But that's the cold room. Right over here is uh, a wall that's actually going into the salon. And so we would like to go ahead and break open this wall and see it through to the salon where the bookshelves are to kind of give us light from that window and a better flow of traffic. Uh, again, here is the uh, oven. And it goes back uh, quite a ways here uh, into the back and this is uh, where we're gonna go back into the back of the oven and take out about eight feet of the back of the oven. There's no reason for me to need an oven to bake 100 loaves of bread at a time. So we're going to go ahead and work on getting that a little bit more manageable. Okay, so here we are. Uh, guy just put in a new light there for me, so I have a light in the front part of the kitchen. Uh, it's very uh, functional for what I need it to be. Um, I've been cooking all kinds of dinners and having guests over for dinner, and it's been working out great. Now, this is the uh, front end of the uh, area here. And this is a bit of a mess. Now, uh, we haven't really touched anything in here yet. We're taking out that shower and we're going to be building a pantry in there. And then right here, we're going to make this into an herb garden area. Once we open up those um, shutters, uh, it's just a uh, so much light in here you would not believe it so it would be great to grow some herbs back in this area is what we're thinking so that's that then we go in here and we have the uh, bakery storeroom uh, which was actually used for the bakery, and of course we have that big bay window. Uh, we went ahead and yesterday, uh, we uh, pressure washed all of the awnings out there, and boy, they sure do look good now. We haven't been able to install a light in here yet, uh, because apparently it's on a different circuit of some sort. Uh, but we were able to install a light here. Uh, and so now we have light in the salon. So this is the salon. Uh, and uh, uh, as you can see, it's got lots of light now. Uh, right here is where we're going to be uh, taking this out and putting in an entryway. 
uh, that's going to uh, go into the kitchen and allow a little bit uh, better flow of traffic there uh, because before you'd have to walk all the way around uh, to get into the kitchen area. Uh, so that's going to happen there. This is the side door and uh, we accidentally knocked out a pane of glass uh, because the door got stuck on the bottom and when I pushed it the glass came out. So that's happened. Um, but we've got the light working in here. Guy's got the lights working just about everywhere. Now here is a little area that we were going to use maybe to uh, put together flowers or uh, something along those lines. We might even take it out and reuse that sink. I'd love to use that type of sink in my kitchen after it's been reglazed. But anyway, we haven't quite decided about that one yet. But when you go back in here, uh, right here on this back end is where we're going to be knocking this all out uh, and it's going to be the back end of the oven that we're going to be taking out here. Uh, there's the little desk that Mom and Jenny insisted that I get and I like it, so here it is. So that's going to be all for today uh, because tomorrow or later on this afternoon I'm going to go ahead and take you on a tour upstairs and tell you what we're doing there. Now um, also I want to be able to take you up into the attic and show you what we have planned for there. Because we're able to remove uh, some of the uh, chimneys there, we're able to uh, take a lot of the weight off by reinforcing this beam here. Uh, we should be able to take some weight off onto the second floor to remove a pole that's been standing in the hallway. And then also we'll be able to uh, remove uh, two of the big, huge uh, boards up in the attic that will really open up the attic for us. But I'll show you that uh, tomorrow. So anyway, uh, that's what the first floor of the house looks like for now. Uh, and uh, we're functioning nicely, uh, camping out, and it's been comfortable. So uh, thank you all, and I will talk to you again soon.